Hello guys, welcome back to another scratch tutorial. In this tutorial, I will show you part 2 of the 2D car physics we are making. So in the previous part, we made this, all the scripts for the car. And now, we want to make the scripts for our wheels, okay? So, let's um, just get started, okay? So before we start, we have a few variables to add make sure you add these all of these for the sprite only it's id tmp and y velocity make sure you do that okay so without further ado let's get started okay so when green flag clicked we will set our offset x to 33 and make sure you use the as asset in the link down below because if not um, you'll have a different number and I don't know how to calculate that and you'll set offset y to 12 set id to 1 and then we will go to x item 1 of car and item 2 of car we will change our x by 0 minus offset x do the same thing for the y change y by 0 minus offset y okay now we can create a clone for myself and then we'll change our x by offset x times 10 after that we'll change our id by 1 and then we will broadcast a new message called dot okay so now in the bottom here we'll put in when i receive start we'll put in a forever loop we will set our tmp variable to our direction we will then position our wheel which will make a new block position wheel run without screen refresh put it right there and then we will also add another one named collision script make sure this one is run without screen refresh put it right there and now we will put in a turn right Oh wait, put in a point in direction TMP. We will put in a turn right. Speed times five degrees. And then we'll make another block. We'll name it save info run without screen refresh and we'll put it right at the bottom okay so now we will put the position wheel here save info right here and the collision script here okay so in our position wheel we'll put in a go to x actually we'll duplicate this go to x item 1 of car y item 2 of car then we'll point in direction item 3 of car and then we'll turn right 90 degrees we'll move offset y steps and then we'll turn left 90 degrees and then we'll put in an if else block our ID 
equals to 1. Then we will move 0 minus offset x steps. Else, we'll just move offset x steps. So that's it for the position wheel. Now we will go to our collision script. So define collision script. We will put in a big if and else here. If we are touching our ground sprite, then we will point in direction to the minus here. Item three of car. And then we will put in a repeat until block not touching ground then we will move 0 0.5 steps and also we have to put in 90 right there and then below that we'll put in negative 0 0.5 steps and then we'll set our y velocity to 0 else We'll change our y velocity. No, change our y velocity by negative 0.2. We don't want a big force. And then we will put in a change y by y velocity. And then we'll put in an if touching ground. We will put in set y velocity to abs of y velocity then we'll change y by y velocity and then we'll set our y velocity to zero and then finally we'll put in a go to x floor of x position and floor of y position so now let's go to our save info script our last script okay so we'll put in an if else block our id equals to one we will put in a replace item one of wheel one with round x position we'll duplicate that and then we'll put in item two of wheel one with y position and lastly item three of wheel one with our y velocity then we'll duplicate all of this put it in the else and we'll change all of this to wheel 2 and make sure you, all of your lists have three items here you can add it by pressing this button and just like that let's, te let's test this and there we go we have a fully functioning 2d physics of a car okay so that's it for this series and tutorial so thank you for watching, please do leave a like, comment, share and do subscribe and uh, I'll see you in the next video, bye.